Tonight, London plays host to the world. Swedes as well. Uh, Marianne Katrin, this is of uh, Erebro in Sweden. She's a student of uh, physical training, physical education. Blue eyed blonde, 5 feet 10 inches tall, 33, 22, 34. That's uh, Marianne Katrin, Miss Sweden. Miss Sweden! Well, this is the lady who, to whom I owe an apology. Actually, I got her name wrong the first time round. Her name, full name, is uh, Mary Ann Katrine Stavin, who comes from Erebro. She's 20 years old, a student of uh, physical education. Another of the girls, first time in London. Very keen to meet Ryan O'Neill, but it's a great shame he unfortunately couldn't be with us here tonight. He brought a note from his mum. That's Miss Sweden. Here's the first of the final seven. Miss Sweden. Well, you look very happy. Oh, I am. <laughs> I understand that, uh, that you've been to America before. Yes, I have. Where did you visit when you were over there? In North Dakota and Minnesota. North Dakota and Minnesota? Yes. Hmm. Do you do a lot of traveling? No, I just with some relatives there. Uh, I have a real good time. I think people like to uh, know a little bit about the, the girls, um, some inside things. I mean, what makes you, what makes you happy, particularly happy? Oh, it's, it's a wonderful uh, feeling. <laughs> I don't know what to say. <laughs> I'm sure it is a wonderful feeling, and you're saying everything just about right. Thank you very much. Congratulations on being selected one of the seven. Ladies Thank and gentlemen, you. Miss Sweden. That, that for 26 years you've had the tradition of announcing the results backwards. That's what we normally do, Andy, yes. We normally announce them backwards. Yeah. Well, it's, it's your show. You can read them upside down or sideways or any way you want as long as, as I'm the first to kiss the winner. Well, I don't know whether it's uh, sort of the, because you're here, Andy, but we've had the toughest job this year we've ever had. You know the judges actually picked five different winners at the beginning and we, I, ha and we had to have a revote. I can believe it. Anyway, I'll tell you what, if you'd like to go back where they're so tense, and as you can imagine with that... I'm going to go start puckering up right now. You're going back there and join them. <laughs> I shall now announce the results in reverse order. And Miss World 1977 is Miss Sweden. What a sensation! That's Mary Ann Katrine Stavine, 20 year old student of physical training from uh, a town called Erebro. Obviously, totally stunned by the whole uh, occasion. She's got the sash on now. She's Miss World 1977. A check for £5,000, pounds, and during the next 12 months, she will work and earn something to the value of £15,000. Pounds. Hugs and kisses and tears with Mrs. Morley there. One of those hands holds the uh, silver trophy for Miss World. The poor girl is uh, obviously totally stunned as she takes the throne of Miss World. And Cindy Breakspear, performing her last function of her year as Miss World 1976, 
crowns her successor, Mary Stavine, a worthy successor. In the traditional manner, full of tears and emotion and uh, incredible turn up for the book, this is. Incredible. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss World 1977, Miss Sweden, Miss World.